you were to play in my band or have played in other people's bands, like R&B bands, and you have to learn music off the record, the first thing you remember is the music is just a, a sketch. The record is just a sketch. Making records and playing live are two completely different things. The things I can do in the studio are things you cannot do live sometimes, and so you use your imagination. So the first thing I would do is like just groove on the beat. You just for me. Which is the foundation of all the music. I play much less. Boom. Boom. One, yeah. And that's basically the groove. And all those feels that you hear is you just use your, yeah, use your discretion. Also, in the music, you would have your leader there. And the most important part of the song is your part. <laughs> hey, my part? Yeah. He's supposed to be playing that. And it's all about the groove. So basically, when you play live, stripping away things is what makes things groove harder. It's like not thinking about them as two parts, but just sort of the foundation, which is the, the lower notes. And that's how I would approach it. Because making the record is, I just sort of sampled and myself and pieced it together. You know, and so I, my approach when I do stuff live is just to find a groove, which will make the people groove. <laughs> Not necessarily the parts, so yeah. Um, but basically, it's a it's two bass lines, and then I just sort of blended them together, kind of thing. So that's what it is. So <laughs> Did I explain that right? Uh, Clearly. I, yeah. yeah. So it's clear. It's just like live is different than a record. That's the only thing I can really express. Making a record and making music are two different things. Yeah. So that's all. Um, okay. So. Yeah. We're live. This is what we're doing. Yeah. Now, is this a tune where we could open up and play, possibly have a solo or something? Yeah, what? definitely. I mean, you've played with me before. Um, I'm a person that comes from the go-go vibration and the uh, sort of improvisational music vibration. So I always create music where, you know, lyrically there's a structure. You know, you do the verse, the chorus, but it's always open to interpretation. Uh, Always, always ready to open up and let the person's creativity go wherever it wants to. So that that is definitely an element of it. But you you want to do that? <laughs> yeah. Uh, could you play with us oh. and uh, we'll jam a little bit and uh, do something.